Now, Shane, we are, we are obviously officially in the full-blown Christmas season because I don't know if you noticed on your way in this morning, all the lights are on everywhere around town. It looks very pretty. Yeah, I had, oh. my, he- I had my head on my phone, so I didn't notice it. Well, I, 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 but I, apparently you said it looked beautiful. It did. It's not, well, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a bit of a fan. So, you know, we know that it, it, it's, it's Christmas. It's Christmas party season as well. And obviously, Minister uh, for Health Stephen Donnelly has said that Christmas parties can go ahead if the COVID-19 rules are followed. And I suspect, much like this office, lots of people are talking in yeah. their office offices and mm. their workplace is kind of going will we have one won't we have one what kind of shape and form should it take how big should it be what do you make of it uh, it look it's a tricky one and I, I sort of think I kind of like what Neffert are doing at the moment and I think you, you we were chatting about it earlier and you, you summed it up well as sort of saying we're they're treating us like adults and I actually think that's the way we need to go and I think it's about what everyone's individual choice is like I'm going to the match tonight with 50,000 other people I'm kind of happy to do that I'll go for a couple of drinks beforehand I'd probably prefer to stay outside having a few drinks and when it comes to Christmas parties I'd be happy to go with a smaller party, say the breakfast team or whatever, uh, for for uh, a lunch or whatever. And, and we're actually the nicest crew in, in News Talk, we to are, be honest. Absolutely. And look, we might do an, we might, I think we're all talking about doing ancient tests before we do it. As regards a bigger, wider Christmas party, I'm not sure I'm calm. I'd be comfortable doing that, I have to say. And look, that's just me. There'll be loads of people who'd be dying to do it, and I totally get it. And I don't think they should be banned or anything, but just on a personal basis, I'm not sure I'd be. I'd want to meet with you know go to if today it was a Christmas party, of 150 or 200 people. I'm not sure I'd be comfortable there. Yeah, I, and I, I I did say that about being treated like adults. I like that. I know that people are out there kind of going, oh, it's mixed messages. That they opened up everything and then they told us to half our contacts. But what I think it's not mixed messages. I sure, think yeah, what they're saying is. You know, take personal responsibility. We're going to treat you like adults. We're going to say, yes, you are allowed to do all these things, but that's not a target. That's something you can do. And I, you know, will go to uh, as well, if there's a, a thing for, for the breakfast team. We're not a, a huge team. Um, something like that. So I think I think that's fine. Ten people, you know, it seems within the guidelines. And I think we, we you know, we're, we're a relatively sensible, <laughs> relatively sensible bunch. But but I do think that there are issues. Until the but second bottle. I, 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 <laughs> the price of wine is going up. Have you heard? This is a terrible thing.